Well today we're going to be looking at setting you task three. Task three will take you through from today which is in the last week of February uh, through to uh, just past growth stage 30 so it'll include making your growth stage 30 decisions around this this crop. Uh, the majority of the teams picked uh, an end of October through to first week of November uh, drilling date uh, and what we'd like you to do in terms of plant numbers counted is take the national average um, loss, uh, field loss at drilling into account which is roughly 30%, it's actually 67 to be totally accurate but if we work on 70% of what you drilled actually establishing that will allow each team uh, to count back from their uh, proposed planting number uh, and come down to a, a seed uh, or plant count per square meter. So if you individually work on that you'll have your, your plant count. Um, because we drilled um, all of the crops through the last week of, no, uh, of October into November uh, it's often the case that although you'd all plan to roll your seed beds often the case that that can't happen because of damp weather at that, that stage uh, and again we'd like to set you within the task the fact that uh, you were unable to roll uh, your seed beds. Um, so that's now giving us quite a bit of surface clod um, sitting around uh, on the surface of the, of the soil. Uh, you know that there was black grass uh, in this field so uh, we'd like again for you to take into account uh, the impact of um, black grass control going into the spring uh, as these clods weather down and potentially release um, uncontrolled black grass seed. We are at the end of February, we're just at the start of a forecast for very very cold weather, very frosty weather through the next two weeks and into around about the 9th of March. Um, so it's highly likely that these clods will be pretty weathered by the time they come out the other side of those those weather conditions. From the point of view of plant establishment um, <clears throat> it's nice and even not too bad at all. Plants at this stage are, are nice and green um, but they are all at a growth stage typically at a growth stage of uh, around three leaves uh, and if we look closely in this plant here we can just see the first tiller just starting to produce, so being produced. So uh, again, if you work on the basis of your plants at this stage are at three leaves and just producing their first tiller, and what we'd like you to do is propose what treatments you would apply uh, in terms of fertilizer and foliar treatments to this crop to push it for yield, make it create tillers, uh, and take it through um, within this task through to the uh, following task at growth stage 31. So just think at the moment between end of February through to growth stage um, 30 which might well be the beginning of April this year because of cold weather. Um, how will you manipulate and treat these crops from now through to that period?